Hello. Hi. How are you? Good. <laughs> Introduce yourself. Uh, I'm Samuraya Karbaradar. Uh, I was born in Istanbul, Turkey. Uh, I have a PhD degree uh, in geophysics. Um, and my specialty was cartography and satellite imagery. So I have been uh, interested in uh, visual uh, scientific products for a long time. But in 2007, um, I styled myself as an artist, which was very difficult, uh, but it was a much better state of mind, uh, as one of my uh, favorite uh, painters said for himself. Um, and in these paintings, uh, I am concerned with uh, this individual uh, who is uh, trying to make sense of uh, her or his environment. So, um, so uh, I believe that uh, like our uh, brain, uh, our body, our skin, uh, our face has a memory and with every gesture we reveal some part of this memory. Uh, and these paintings uh, are uh, the result of um, uh, are the result of a reflection of this memory. Um, uh, my favorite piece in this exhibition is uh, this one. Um, I have been working with watercolors, uh, watercolor and um, and soft pastel for a while. Uh, but after a while, I started doing some collage. Uh, because uh, with collage I can create a conceptual depth on the surface. So I am not interested in any uh, Renaissance depth, uh, but a conceptual very in uh, depth, uh, very close to the surface, uh, and I like to create like flattened uh, figures. Um, on the other hand, uh, with the collage, it is uh, it is important for me to uh, use the sensational meaning of the material. Like if I am uh, using very transparent or very opaque material, I can create a depth and use the uh, the, the meaning uh, of, of the material itself. Like uh, this one, uh, I use a tissue paper which is closer to a skin uh, color. Uh, and it looks like a ski uh, and also a kind of transparent plastic which uh, covers the whole body and it actually there is a drawing at the back but uh, when I created it with a collage it was uh, it was kept uh, at the back uh, and this figure is uh, uh, is like uh, like one piece uh, you can feel the insecurity of the figure, uh, the ambiguity uh, in her look, uh, and also uh, the uh, the anxiety which uh, she uh, wants to keep from outside. Um, and this, uh, there are four pieces in this exhibition uh, which looks like uh, this figure, um, and the, the name of the series is Seated Figure. So. Uh, I uh, styled, um, I collected uh, some pictures of figures uh, from different magazines and newspapers from different times uh, and uh, keep the frame constant in all the pictures and try to extract the sitting uh, figure. Uh, then I worked on them and most of the time uh, I am interested in this um, uh, the ambiguity, the insecurity, and the um, anxiety uh, of, of, of the uh, figure who feels a kind of adoption, uh, adoption, uh, uh, desperation around uh, himself or herself. Um, and so I'm thinking of, co uh, I, I plan to continue with this series. Uh, this is the latest paintings in this uh, latest uh, paintings in this uh, exhibition. Um, I think uh, there is one another uh, series in this exhibition which is called Nausea. You'll see the three of them here. Uh, it's uh, it's an autobiographic uh, series. 
it's a uh, it's a auto portrait I should say um, and all these pieces are actually one painting uh, t three paintings but uh, they have it, it they uh, represent a time sequence like the first second and third one like it tells a story it's a uh, story of a changing mood uh, uh, from the uh, from the good to the uh, to the bad, uh, uh, and uh, it's the um, it it is uh, very uh, stable. Uh, it it is actually the image. It's a photo uh, as a source, but uh, I would like to show three of them next to each other and create a sense of story. Uh, Nausea is um, uh, it was uh, one of the books I was very uh, impressed, and the mood uh, in the book of uh, Sark uh, was uh, exactly the, um, the, the the feeling I was feeling when I was moving from one place to another. So I just wanted to visualize uh, that feeling uh, in this series. Uh, in another series uh, in this in this exhibition is uh, called Couple, the couple. Uh, actually, the, uh, the the source photograph uh, for this uh, for these paintings was uh, uh, an old photo of my parents and also a photo of my sister. Uh, I started with the idea of being a couple for a long time uh, and uh, the intimacy of the relationship, uh, and I would like to make it uh, a, a romantic. Uh, but also very intimate uh, 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 vi visuality. Um, but all, but uh, every, most of uh, what some people asked me about the second painting, which was uh, only uh, one side of this couple, and its name was still couple. Uh, here I wanted to show that even there was one figure, one face, it still represents uh, some uh, one part of that couple notion, uh, and even it is um, even it is it has realistic uh, back it has a realistic background. Finally, it was a drawing uh, with watercolors and soft pasta. Uh, I in, I uh, included uh, some collage piece on the top uh, on on the face. Uh, it is it is transparent. Uh, it creates a conceptual depth on the surface. Uh, it um, uh, it is like the face want to show him for her uh, show herself, but also she wants to keep uh, herself uh, away uh, from her surrounding. So uh, it is a kind of uh, insecurity of the individual. Uh, but uh, it gives a sense of uh, also intimacy. The other uh, painting is uh, another couple, uh, a girl with her pet. Uh, I didn't want to uh, throw a dog or cat uh, in a, co in a co uh, classical uh, you know, sense of having a pet kind of thing. But uh, it, uh, that's why the pet look is an interesting pet, like a raccoon. But there is this intimate relationship with this pet, and they are happy together. So this is the image of that couple, uh, the, a close relationship, uh, a very intimate uh, relationship, and it gives strength uh, to a person uh, to be in that uh, relationship.